Welcome to Comic Cocktails, Derek and Ian. I was a Dan because you've been gone for like two months. Hey, it's one letter Actually, difference. Probably it's one okay. month. And we made a big sticky mess here. Uh, I was not involved in that. <laughs> I think that was for another channel. <laughs> that was a different Browsers. Yeah. 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 Simple syrup style. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so I don't know what we're doing. So me and Ian, Ian walked over with this thing. Yeah, I, I so, told the story to you, but that doesn't mean everybody else on I am playing so. stupid right now. All right, so. I'm going to lick this off. I'm not going to watch that. Uh, so I was in New Jersey a few weeks ago uh, from my friend's housewarming party. And his neighbor came over and he works for Allied Beverages. And he was a cool guy. We started talking. And he was telling me about this stuff that he had. It's called uh, Slow and Low Rock and Rye. And uh, it is a rye. Rye whiskey. That's, That's a whiskey. It says uh, straight rye whiskey, raw honey, navel orange, rock candy, and bitters. Navel orange. And... He was telling me that the history of rock and rye comes from back in the day when you'd go to a saloon. There was, you know, two choices of what to drink. You had water and you had whiskey. And the whiskey was whatever they had. So a lot of times it was just shitty, right. you know, low-end whiskey. With water probably added to probably it to stretch with it water out. Probably stretch it out, yeah. But uh, over time, people realized that if you had rock candy to it, it would kind of cut the, the bitterness or the, the, the harshness of the whiskey. So people started ordering rock and rye. So this company... I don't know if the company's uh, Hochstadler's. Hochstadler's? It looks German. Can you see that? <laughs> yes. Hoch, hoch. Is that? Yeah. Hochstadler's. There we go. I knew you Except that. that the T doesn't need to be there, but. Stadler's. No, it doesn't, does it? No. Actually, yes, it does. It, it's High, Stad high yeah, City. Uh, okay. Unless it's two A's. No, it's High City. Uh, not High State. Okay. I think State is two A's. So, yeah. That's the company, and they make this stuff, and that's why they call it that. So... I figured we'd uh, Drink try it. it together. And it comes with, it's got that little cool, like the old school Kraken peel top. Kraken? Kraken. You know, these things, where you kind of peel it off like the old, oh, the old juices sweet. have, the yeah. whole tab comes off. It's the pull tab. and But it's got bitters and everything in there, and citrus, you said. I heard you say navel oranges. Yeah, I'm just going to pour this whole thing, because Jen will drink it. Yeah. <laughs> really? <laughs> Yes, because she's huge into whiskey and bitters. I know, right? Brianna's leaving. I know, I'm on her way. She's on her way. Huh. Oh, Brianna's leaving. 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 Which is a little higher no, than standard. That's, that's good. Actually, that's really it. tasty. Why you didn't you didn't use the cool tasting glasses? Oh, the Norland glasses? Yeah. I didn't grab them. I should. Were they over there? That's good. There's not there a lot of ethanol in it there. anywhere. Anyway. You immediately get orange. Yeah. Like a, a zesty little orange. You get the sweetness and you get the orange immediately. But and, and I get the honey too. I don't understand. It's good. They actually use navel orange. They must make an essence out of it or something. They, or they clarify it or something. That's or maybe it's the bitter. Work. <laughs> like, it's, I mean, yes, I could totally see a high end craft bar doing like a, a clarity on a or I mean, using a what a centrifuge to like clear it out. But like, right. well, I mean, this is a sample. Does it taste tinny? No. It, no. No. The can. Yeah, think, but you get the burny alcohol, so you're like. I don't taste it's inviting. Tinniness. I don't know. I I, I don't Do think you? I've ever tasted no, but I don't I don't really taste tinniness in a lot of things. Yeah, I mean it's coated on the inside, I'm sure. Maybe. Yeah. But it might also depend on what you've got for a uh, material, like a, an orange juice or like a pineapple juice that comes in the tins. What was it? The the ch oh, cherries we have. Yeah, you it's said probably has the tinniness. acid. All yeah. those citruses yeah. are really yeah. acidic, so they probably eat away at the linings and yeah. stuff. This is actually really good, isn't it? I was. I'm, I mean, I'm not terribly surprised, but I'm surprised It's like that silky. It, yeah. And the flavors are really good. You, this no, is a well good It's well-balanced for, yeah. for what... You could buy these things? I don't know. He gave me that. I don't know if it's a sampler <laughs> or if that's how they distribute. I, I would hope this is probably the normal size, because this is... That's going to fuck you up. It's 100 millis. That's two shots, so... Yeah, two shots of whiskey. I mean, if you gave somebody like, like the, you know, like the... The twelve ounce or what are they? What are no five ounces? What what are the um the blue ones? What is the company that does the fucking gives you wings? Red Bull. Oh yeah, like a Red Bull can. Yeah, that would burn the, you. The original Red Bulls were probably about twice that size. 
The, the uh, small yeah, ones? Yeah, those are dead to me. Yeah. I, 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 why, if you're going to drink a Red Bull, why would you go small? It's like, if you can't get your heart to explode, you're doing it wrong. You're going to drink three at once with a funnel right in the middle. Speaking of someone whose heart is probably going to explode pretty soon. Well, what? not not soon, but like... Pretty <laughs> soon. You're not ready to write. It's probably closer to having their heart explode than you. I've, I've weaned myself off those. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, but they help your yeah. metabolism, right? Yeah, that'll bounce off a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying? That's not a thing? That, Solomon maybe. says you can buy those cans in the liquor stores. Like the buzz Oh, you balls. can? That's what Solomon says. Okay. I don't know what a buzz ball yeah, is, but that I'm, also sounds kind of dangerous. I'm not familiar with these, so I mean, that's... Yeah, that's... I'm, I'm quite surprised that this tastes like... Like, if you... If you serve that at a craft bar, midline craft bar, in like a, like a, like a Sazerac would be served... Yeah. Be pretty damn good. It's almost like a you, you put it in like a brandy snifter or something like yeah. that because the, you, the, the orange smell. It's is very really vibrant. Good. It's the vibrant. only it's thing that might keep people in is it's a little sweet. It is a little sweet, but it's not. It's a rye though. I, I don't it's know. It's not it's like, like sticky sweet. It's not like a liqueur or anything. I mean, it's, but it has like that consistency, like the thickness, the silkiness. I don't know if that's the whole thing or if it's the honey. Well, it's funny because that. you you get it. But it doesn't linger. It's no, like, it doesn't leave a sticky residue. Yeah, there's nothing sticky about that. It's burny. Like, it leaves a little burniness does, in your yeah. belly. Like, it's not fake. It's That's alcohol in there. Lots of alcohol. Hello, in Scotland. There. Hola. I was born in Scotland. That's why I noticed that. Were you Maybe. conceived there or born there? Speaking of being born, Jen was born many years ago today. I was oh, born yeah. many years ago. Happy Jen birthday, Jen. Jennifer's Thanks. birthday. <laughs> uh, unless you're actually watching this video, then yeah. it's... I don't know when this is going to go out, but it won't be on her birthday, because that's today. This is the live stream. Yeah. yeah. Live, stream live stream date. Uh, so, birthday. this is... Since... We haven't done a review in a while, mainly because nobody's going to watch this. We're going to get, like, yeah. 350 views, 400 views. So, suck it, all the people who bypass our reviews. Um, this is actually a good thing. I mean, this... I think this is worth trying. If you're interested in trying... If you, if you like whiskeys and ryes and Yeah, whatever, and it's, it's, it's approachable because it's it not is. too explosive. This might be a good entry-level, like, whiskey for someone who wants to be interested in drinking whiskey. You know uh, what I mean? I, I, you know, I'm, I'm torn between what part of the, the focus that I like the most really comes down to that, the, the orange. Mm. Like, it's so zesty. It is. And, but, but not like a bitter zesty. No, no. Yeah. But, like... Like you, like you zested an orange and smelled it, like that bright citrus. Like I wonder mm. if they, if they make a tincture or something, and they're just adding in like citrus bitters, or yeah. something, like to get like strong citrus flavor or something. I don't know. It's just very citrus. Yeah, it's but it's not like it's not orange juice. It's not like a screwdriver. It's, but it's not, not like, like a bitters. It's not like it. it it's like I a, don't know because citrus bitters aren't really too bitter. Like right. Regan's. That's true. Yeah. Regan's. Uh, Regan's. This could be pretty. I'm looking for citrus now. Citrus bitters? I don't have, I have lemon. Does that count? Yeah, orange right here. Scrappy's orange. Like, uh, yeah, I, I don't think these are that. Yeah, that's not terribly bitter. I mean, that's, no. But it is, I mean. But it's zesty. But there's, there's even more zest in here than there is in there. And that's an orange, like, yeah, bitter. Yeah, read the ingredients. Diane wants to know if they're on the can. They are. Yeah. Um. Uh, Warning, according to the Surgeon General, hold on. Straight rye whiskey, raw honey, navel orange, raw candy, and bitters. I wonder if it's navel orange, raw candy. Because there's no color. Right. Oh. That would make sense, because now that now you can that's how you yeah, can get that concentrate. But there's no comma. There's no comma anyway. Yeah. No, but that does it would be easier if you use raw candy and you made an hmm. oleo yeah. out of it and make an oleosaccharum because you yeah. get that vibrancy out of True. an oleo because it's all oh, the peels. Oh, yeah. Maybe they do that. Maybe they make they an oleosaccharum the out of the... extract the oil out of the peel. Using the raw candy in the peel. Yeah. I can see that. That makes sense. I think Sadie's going to the second floor. Or something. No, I think Brianna's friend's probably oh. here. That's Kevin. Oh. I so! Was, I was born in Grenick. Or Danoon. Wherever the hospital is. My parents lived in one or the other. I, I think I was born in Grenick and we lived in Danoon. Those are weird words. That's really hard to put down. Uh, mm. I gotta say something, Jen. This is good. I can just keep sipping that. I know. It's really, uh, all right. it's really tasty. Uh, so, here's what you need to do. Just watch... You know what? Watch the damn video. It's too late if you didn't because you're gone. But I just... If you're watching it now, you should go and watch all the reviews because they're useful. And for some reason, people yeah. don't want to watch them. I get 50% less people watching reviews. In this case, it doesn't matter. Somebody handed us something. I don't have a problem reviewing something. It doesn't... 
yeah. which cost me a few minutes editing, and these ones are quick. Cut, begin, cut in, and I'll learn the graphics and shit in there. So, He's amazing. Um, and no coupon codes, so you, you're you fucked with that. No um, coupon code? No, because I don't know what? when it's going to go out. Oh, okay. Yeah, good point. But okay. Sometimes I put them out, and I say the coupon code, and it's already fucking expired. Well, I'm not going to say it then. No, don't no, say it. <laughs> I was but there to, is one. I was about to say, what about... If you put the what? number 18 at whatever month you're watching it, and you're in 2018, you might, <laughs> you might be a redneck. Be I don't know. That's the only thing I can think of. Alright, ready? Sidebar? There's some videos over there. Maybe I'll put the damn reviews. So you keep watching them. Down below, you can pick up the Bartender Starter Kit. It is in stock. Put some good ones over there. I will put some good ones. Yeah. I will put them all. Just tiny little boxes. I'll put all the good. That's it. <laughs> we teach you how to drink. They're all good, aren't they? Everything we do is good. <laughs>